Best way to survive. I'm over the walls, I'm gonna expose Fizco's lies and make them pay for what they've done. You really think it'll fly? I know it will. As soon as I make a few more adjustments to the launch mechanism. Wrench. Okay, I need you to lift up the carriage a bit more. Like this? Now keep it there while I tighten this. Don't let go. I might have to let go. Not yet. I have to let go now. No! Yeah, did you see that? You're lucky I was here. Fuck up. Yeah. I meant you. Well, what was I supposed to do? Of course it's my fault. Thanks, Dad, who's not my real dad. Huh. What's that? Chaos Squad! Try it! You'll like it! Photo Boots connect you to other players for Chaos Squad, our unique multiplayer mode. Hold on objectives to build up chaos and collect team power-ups. Play a cooperative night defense. The more chaos, the harder it is, but your team power-ups help. Complete the night defense to earn cool stuff. Consumerism! Look for a photo booth anytime you want to play online. Want better amps? Play Chaos Squad to earn upgrades for your amps. Then use them in single player.
Guess I'll just head back to the base. Maybe I can help him rebuild the glider. Wish there was a quicker way to get there. That was easy. Don't worry, man. He's been pissed at me plenty of times. It's not like I did it on purpose. I want to get out of this city just as much as he does. Hey, let's make lemons out of this lemonade. He's got to rebuild, right? Hardest part is going to be the propeller. Why don't you head over to the old factory district, have a look around. I need to find a propeller. The propeller has blades. Guess I'll start at the old Crown Blades factory. Yeah. Hey, as long as you're out there, try getting some combos and building up style. Use those amps. Trust me, amps can make or break you out there. have an icon dealy thing on his head, so am I supposed to chase him? Yes, you should follow him. Okay, scary, helpful voice man. Should be another way around. Amazing. Are you like a superhero or something? What? It's just the way you move, the, the things you do. Well, uh, good luck, kid. My name's Sam, but since you saved me and all, let me do something for you. Nah, 
Not unless you know where I can find a propeller. A propeller? Wait, wait! I have an idea. Oh, this is gonna be perfect. Follow me! We gotta get out of here! Follow me! Oh man, what is that thing? It looks dangerous. I'll take care. Watch out! More of them! Let's go through the shipping yard! Sure, what could go wrong? Up there! On the shipping container! Right now, Floyd. I found a guy that might help. All right. Well, you just keep on keeping on then. Hide in shipping containers all day. Look out! You're my hero! That's cool. I'm not taking any sidekicks right now, though. Go ahead, I'll follow you. Oh my god, we're stuck. We're never gonna get out. We're all gonna die. Oh my god, you're right, we are going to die! Wait, really? No. We're just going in circles. Ugh, think, Sam, think. Here's the plan. We're gonna railjack that train. That's brilliant! And how lucky that you can drive a train! What? I can't drive a train. Then why would you even suggest stealing a train? Because we are about to die. Well, in that case, I have played several hundred hours of Choo Choo Simulator. That sounds boring and awful, but potentially life-saving. Through that barricade! Look! Here they come! Now we're really gonna die! Yeah, aren't tornadoes the tornadoes of death? Let's clear. Let's get out of here. Put on your big boy pants and follow me. I'll see if I can get the train started. You check the train for supplies and keep the OD off me. Check the train for supplies. What the hell does that even mean? I don't know. Build a weapon or something. Oh, okay. Huh. Let me see what I can put together. I guess this was heading to Toys for Terrorists? One of these. Some of this. Some of those. 
cute and explodey. Like chocolate and peanut butter. go that far. Come on, our safe house is just down the street. No. So, Sam, what were you doing at that factory all by yourself? Oh, you know, looking for supplies for me and my friends. They send me out because they're all doing other important stuff back at the base. Important stuff? Like what? I'm not really sure. Yeah, these friends of yours, are they really friends? I like to think so. We were all students at Oxford West College. Oxford West? Isn't that the school that all the rich and famous send their kids to when they have to go into rehab or whatever? Yeah, but it's a great school. I got a scholarship, the only scholarship. Everybody else paid their way in. Anyway, when the OD attacked campus, only a few of us made it out alive. One thing before we go in, my friends are having a hard time coping, so go easy on them. If we can get everyone working together, we're gonna make you an amazing propeller. Hey guys, I want you to meet my new friend. Shut up, Sam. You suck at friends, Sam. They're not bad people, they're just spoiled. They don't know how to deal with a mutant apocalypse. I know how to make them come around. If only I could get them to listen to me. Maybe you can help me help them. You want me to be your life coach? Yes. What should I do first, coach? Step one, never call me coach again. Step two, never do that again. Step three, let's see what your friends need to get upright and start working on that propeller. You with those preppy kids? My friend Calissa says they're selling clothes and stuff. You go see her if you want to change. Oh, and listen, don't be afraid to try new things. You never know what's going to fit until you try it on. On that philosophical note, bam, I'm out. If you don't buy so a am I invited to your birthday party like... That top is so cheap and gaudy. Oh, darling, it's so you.
so bored. This freaking sucks. That's Dirk. His mom is an award-winning physicist, and his dad is an astronaut. He's really good with aerodynamics. Aerodynamics? How convenient. He's also a health nut. He only drinks, like, the most expensive water on the planet. Bora Bora water. You can't afford it. There's a bottling plant a few blocks away. If you can bring back a couple bottles for him... Wait a sec. You're telling me that the only thing that will make this guy get off his ass is some brand name bottled water? You don't know him like I do. I don't want to know him like you do. Trust me, once we give him what he wants, he'll help make your propeller. My mother? You wish I was your mother? <laughs> no, I really don't. Anyway, I found a group of worthless, spoiled brats who just happen to be geniuses. I gotta do some stuff for them, then they'll build me a propeller. <laughs> nice! Walter's out at the overpass rebuilding the glider. That propeller's gonna help a lot. Don't tell him I'm working on it. I want it to be a surprise. Walter doesn't like surprise. Oh god, the place is flooded. I guess if I want that precious Bora Bora water, I'm gonna have to drain out this nasty stuff first. Warning. Contamination detected. Facility offline. Awaiting activation of emergency flush system. Time to flush this factory-sized toilet. Emergency flush system activated. Just kidding. Obstruction detected. Pressure level critical. Release safety valves to prevent complete and utter disaster. He's gonna blow. Gotta release those valves. Another emergency flush system is awaiting activation. Emergency flush, emergency flush system number two, awaiting activation. Emergency flush system number three, awaiting activation. Where are they all coming from? Emergency flush system, offline, until you figure out where those OD are coming from. Hey, automated intercom lady. I could do with a little less sarcasm, gay? Okay? You can dish it out, but you can't take it. 
Took out the trash. No, wait, wait, I got another one. What a waste of waste. Now I could do better than that. That was just a bunch of rubbish. Not too British. Please, stop. Yeah, okay, sorry. Time to grab that water and get out of here. <clears throat> Better get this back to what's his face. It doesn't kill him. doors. You did it! I mean, not that I had any doubt that you would. Wait here. Hey, Dirk, I got something I think you might like. Sick. Ah, oh, fuck, that's good. Purest water on Earth. Ah, oh, thanks, Sam, you rock. Yeah, sure, anytime. Sick. 
So, uh, can I get that propeller now? Soon. Dirk will certainly help, but we need to get a couple other people on board. If you don't buy a fortune, you'll be sorry. That's Margaret. She's an engineering major with, like, the highest GPA in the history of the school. But she lost her dog when everything went down, and she hasn't been the same since. Finding that dog will go a long way to helping her depression. Hey, whatever gets me that propeller. There's a dog park across the river that she always went to. I would check there first. I have brilliant new designs for you. Attention, player! <laughs> You earn badges from playing with style. The more stylish you are, the more badges you will earn. When you earn enough badges, trade them in for overdrives. Overdrives give you boosts in your abilities. They're awesome! You can now unlock your first overdrive. Select the empty slot to equip a new overdrive. Want to unlock more overdrives? You gotta earn some badges first. You unlock and equip overdrives in the character page. Play how you want and you'll get better at the things you enjoy. Nice! The dog yeah. park is over in Little Tokyo. You'll have to cross the North Bridge to get there. The bridge? No, oh, I can just jump across on these boats. Boats? Ugh, yikes. Open water scares me. It's just a river, Sam. The Bermuda Triangle. Hey, the Bermuda Triangle is no laughing matter. Hundreds of ships lost. Thousands claimed by the sea. Not only is it a hotbed for tropical storms and magnetic anomalies, but I am pretty sure I read about alien abductions and leftover technologies from Atlantis causing ultrasonic... Sam, I found the dog. You did? No, I just wanted to save the world from the rest of your story. <laughs> just call me when you find the dog. Uh, 
Weird dog. Come here, Pooch. What's your name? Boo Boo? Come on, Boo Boo. Margaret's looking for you. What the fucking fuck? Hey, Sam, did you maybe forget some of the details about Margaret's robo dog? The thing won't follow me back. He must be in some kind of recovery mode. If it doesn't recognize the voice trying to command it, it will only interact with its favorite toy, Cutie Kitty. Listen, there's a toy store pretty close to you. Just try looking there for the kitty launcher, okay? Or you could just tell Margaret her dog is dead. That dog means a lot to her. Fine. Oh, wait, Sam. The dog is following me now. Oh, great. Oh, no, it just committed suicide. Sorry, mission failed. What's next? Just check the toy store before giving up, okay? But giving up is my special move. Uh, stupid dog. That's my cutie kid. Sorry, pal. Sorry, Warrior needs to badly. I am putting myself to the coolest possible use, which is all I think any has ever hoped. I'm gonna mess you up. <laughs> Sam, and I better get my propeller. Don't worry, just bring that back to the dog. Okay, dog, got something you might like. Please work, please. Yeah, you like playing fetch? You want me to throw this thing for you? Hmm, how can I make this fun for me, too? How about... Yeah. Hey, Sam, I got this stupid dog excited. Now, how do I reboot it? Not the best news to break to you, but Margaret has to do that here. <laughs> of course she does. Just try to get used to how he moves. You have a long trek back. Yeah, thanks for the reminder. Boy, fetch! If you fire the cutie kitty near a structure, Boo Boo will do it. So while the dog's in recovery mode, he'll only go places he recognizes. But Margaret always walked Boo Boo over the North Bridge. Try luring him there. One other thing, you can't use your guns. The dog will sense you as a threat and kill you. Well, at least this will all be over. Don't worry, the dog will defend you as long as you have the cutie kitty. Try him out, it's actually pretty cool. <sighs> Go get it! Ready for another? Okay, dog. Sam says you're a killing machine. Let's see if you can kill some OD for me. 
<laughs> Not gonna lie. That was pretty cool. Let's do this, Pooch. All right, Pooch. Let's see if you can make this jump. Okay, where did Margaret walk the dog next? Hopefully it's a place with more things to kill it. Down to the intersection, and then down the main street to Sasquatch and friends. Fetch! That's the one who killed Eddie and took his cutie kitty! Gonna die, bitch! Ah, uh, shit. Let's rock and roll, pooch! One atomic dog fight coming right up. Who got that kitty? Who did? Who got the kitty ready? Thank you, Sam. You're the best. Sure. Anytime. Yeah, really nice work, Sam. Okay, we need to convince just one more person to help. Then we can start building your propeller. Max is the math wizard Oxford West. If anyone can calculate a propeller for optimal lift, it's him. I think he's worried about his parents. Maybe you could go check on them. Max's parents live in the penthouse suite of the tallest tower. Those Fizco execs make a lot of money, you know. Well, there might be a product recall on their latest drink. I'm just saying, I'm sure that can't help the stock price. You'd think, right? But nobody on the outside knows yet. Most of their stockholders probably think everything is running smoothly. With perhaps the exception of Max's parents. Correct. They're probably dead. But there is a chance they made it into their panic room. Oh, of course they have a panic room. I had an entire panic apartment. It just looked like my normal apartment, but with boarded up windows and me inside, panicking. Isn't there a chance Max's parents turned into OD when everybody else did? It's possible. Be careful when you open that panic room door. Fair point. Yeah.
Yeah, I'm here at the Fancy Town Tower. They've given me a heads up that this place was crawling with scabs. How would I know? I'm practically a shut-in after Horror Night. Although, it makes sense. Once you secure the bottom floor, you have all that living space above you. I could find a way to get to the higher floors, is what I know. This'll work. I just need to find something to hook onto and I can make my own way up there. Thank you very much. of ragdoll death used my senses. Barricade doesn't look too solid. That's scab ingenuity for you. Sure, I can bring it down some. Boom! Not making me start at the bottom. Scratch. Hmm, a 
puzzling puzzle. This makes perfect. Let's try again. Panic room here. Let's be on the taller tower. <laughs> Gotta get over to the taller tower. Hey, I just talked to your doctor. Bad news, you're gonna die. <laughs> Unless you drink some overcharge right now! Hey, Scabs, I'm coming for ya! Check the panic room. Please don't make me find some weird sex stuff. <laughs> Voice recorder. Max's parents' dying words? Let's find out. Security breached. Oh, shit. Ok, 
get all the loot. Gotta listen to that voice recording before I head back. Max needs to know what happened to his parents. message that it means you're still alive shame your mother and I are going to live in the Bahamas where cashing out your trust fund so mommy can drink a lot of champagne and daddy doesn't have to get a new job anyway uh, best of luck by the way have you tried drinking our new overcharged drink yet I think you'd like it yeah well at least the dick bag left a message Max is now poor and an orphan we should probably just tell him his parents were skeletons in a bathtub just get back. We'll figure out the least worst thing to tell him. So, Sam, you're sure your friends are going to listen to you now? Sure I'm sure. Thanks to you, they think I did all this great stuff for them. You're sort of a modern-day Cyrano de Bergerac. I have no idea what that means. Go ahead. Well, of course I'm referencing the play, not the real Cyrano. Whatever. I'll be whoever you need me to be, as long as I get that propeller. His parents are still alive, but they're major assholes. He stole his money and left him for dead. Yeah. I'll break the news. Yes! Freedom! Thanks, Sam. Best news ever! So Sam, you expect us to believe you went out and did all this stuff by yourself? I think you had a little help. Who gives a shit what you think? You guys just sit on your asses all day while this hero goes out into the city, all to get you a bunch of useless shit so you can be happy. I don't know about you, but that inspires me makes me want to be a hero to this hero. I know we can do it. Together. We're gonna have to work hard. Uh, Sam forgot one thing. If you don't help him, I'll throw your ass out on the street to fend for yourself. I'm on board with this. Hey, let's get to work. Cool speech. I'm ready. What is it? It's a 3D printer. It's gonna make you a new propeller. Oh, cool. Yeah, I know. Mm, but it needs a faster processor. Of course it does. <sighs> I'll see what I can find. <laughs> 